Thank you. I appreciate the help. I bet they're coming for us. Hey, you! Cloud! Man, am I glad I caught you. Said you're a merc, and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down. They just... I'm sure they're around here somewhere. <sighs> Worried about them, huh? Alright. Oh, thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are... They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I know you. I could really use her help. She always knew where to find the best herb. You haven't seen her, have you? I used up all my meds treating people injured. I could make more, but not with them. So what do you need? You mean you're willing to help me out? Oh, thank you. You'd be doing this town a huge favor. Here's a list of everything I'm looking for. It's you, my good- Oh, hello. The Daily Buzz. You mean- Well, yes, that's fair. <laughs> Here's the scoop. A certain division of Shinra, that shall remain nameless, was planning to seize Corneo's assets. But before they could, the key to his secret vault, within which his misbegotten gains were securely tucked away, was stolen. And my sources tell me that the thief is the Undercity's beloved hero, the unidentified bandit who's been targeting anyone with ties to Shinra or Corneo. Yes! Well, do I have your undivided attention? Kinda, but hurry it up. We don't have- Then I'll make this quick. So, my good Merc, you do remember where the Angel's hideout is, right? Do you remember the death threat she left there? Oh, that. I've decided to seek the silver lining in this. If the Angel of the Slums deigns to take an interest in a humble reporter, <sighs> What are you asking? If you recover the stolen key, feel free to help yourself to the contents of Corneille's vault. 
All I want is knowledge, the identity. So if you happen to learn anything of value, I'd be tremendously grateful to you if you passed it. Bro! Tifa! Damn, is it good to see you guys again? I told you to stop calling me that. Bro, I'm in serious need of your expertise. Lend me a hand! Fine. What? Truth is, I'm, uh, trying to get out of town for, uh, reasons. Yeah, reasons. But the thing is... <laughs> I got mugged! She took it! Took it! I tried to chase her down, but she was real fast-like! I'm begging you, help me out! What'd she look like? Bro! Uh, hold on. Let me think. I wanna get this right. She was a cutie. Black hair. Pretty sure she was wearing a hat. And, uh, oh yeah! She was wearing these striped stockings, too. Kyrie? Which way'd she go? Uh, toward the church, I think. Hey there, man. You I screwed up an order. Mind taking at least one off my hands? I haven't been to the office in days now. Good sweat.
What? It wasn't me. You've got the wrong girl. Never committed a crime in my life. You Kyrie? Uh, Kyrie? Who's that? Can't say I know her, but cool name. <laughs> Someone mugged our friend and took every last skill he had. Sound familiar? Oh, that? <laughs> Ooh, I thought I was in actual trouble. Don't scare me like that. Now I remember you. You're that chick. The one who was spreading lies in Sector 5. Oh yeah, I did do that. <laughs> good times, good times. <gasps> Hold on. I know you, Blondie. You're that merc everyone's talking about. <sighs> Maybe my luck's not so bad. Shinra's after me. You've got to help me. Stole from them too, did you? No. Well, yes, sorta. It's complicated. How was I supposed to know they were Shinra? And now those jerks won't leave me alone. Even though all I took was some ugly key. I mean, what's the big deal anyway? Wait a minute. That was you? <sighs> oh, great. So everyone's talking about it? <laughs> Is this the end? Kyrie, please. Just give us the money you stole from our friend, would you? And the key while you're at it. No way! You're gonna split the second I do! We'll handle Shinra if you give us the key. Deal? It's a deal. Right about now, those Shinra creeps should be hanging out at the Coliseum. They're waiting for a special match to start, starring yours truly. It's the talk of the town. You're joking. Oh, I won't be there. I'm not- It's a miracle you've managed to stay alive. I'll take that as a compliment. Now run along and clean up my mess. You'll get your key once I know I'm safe.
Momo made it back. Silly old boy. Always off in his own world. But I'm glad to see they didn't. The trains haven't been running for... Screw you, Avalanche! A couple of my patients were talking about a behemoth in some underground lab or something. Can't say I've ever heard of a lab like that before, though. Plates aren't supposed to just fall. I mean, what's going on? Stupid old man. What'd you say? What are you doing out here? And where's everyone else? Well, we saw a bunch of tombstones lying on the ground, so we decided to stand them back up. And then I heard laughing coming from somewhere, and when I turned around, everyone was gone. I was alone. Everyone disappeared. Heads up. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you. 
Way. This is where our parents are. They're resting, but we wanted to say hi. Sometimes you just want to do that, you know? I do. Thanks so much for coming to find us. That's another one I owe you. We're gonna head back to the house now. Ms. Foley is probably pretty worried. Hey, Cloud, I found this on the ground. You should take it. I think. Bunch of little smart asses. <laughs> With good hearts. <laughs> <laughs> 